Here we have a 2017 67 plate Mercedes-Benz E220D AMG line. Now with this vehicle you get four superb unscratched unmarked 20 inch alloy wheels in gloss black with this sort of trim around. We have your LED headlights as well as the black Panamerica style front grille with the contrasting chrome front badge. Black front splitter as well as the blacked out styling on this vehicle where you do get the black window trim with the privacy glass on the rear. Now we do get front and rear parking sensors with a rear reversing camera, dual exit exhaust flush, the rear bumper and also the rear diffuser. Now we do have a power release rear tailgate as well. It's underneath. As you can see we do have a nice spacious sized boot. We have the storage net on the left hand side. I'll pop that back down. Now this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches and rear does look superb from every angle. If you go to the rear I'll show you a bit of the interior. Now, as you can see, we do have the half suede and half leather seats throughout with the Isofix point. Pull down RMS just there with two nice size cup holders and also storage just there as well. We also have your storage behind the passenger driver's seat. Black Ashwood trim just there with your integrated speakers and you also have your electric windows. Going to the front, there's a look at the driver's front seat. Electrically adjustable on both front seats are also heated as you can see just there black ashwood trim integrated speakers and your electric windows your electric power forward and mirrors jump in inside the car just down there you have your auto lights foot on the brake you have your keyless start from a touch of a button multi-function steering wheel just there as well touch pads on either side one on the right hand side controls the screen in front of me where the instrument cluster is and the one on the left hand side controls the screen in the center of the car now, as you can see, it is free from any wall lights on the dashboard. It has covered just over 35,240 miles. Now, do you have paddle shift as well? If you should take the car into manual mode and you'll set off your cruise control and speed limiter stalk just there as well. In the centre, we do have the satellite navigation as well as your radio where we do have a DAB. Media connectivity, you can find we do have media interface 1 and 2. Now, they are USB ports. And you do also have Bluetooth phone connectivity just there as well. Now, Bluetooth phone connectivity there too. Now, we do get different drive modes on this vehicle. So, you do get Eco, Comfort, Sport, Sports Plus, and also Individual. Now, Individual, you can adapt to all those different settings to suit your driver preferences. Now, I'll pop the car into reverse. You can see rear reversing camera with your front and rear parking sensors visual display on the left hand side. Coming down here, we have your dual zone climate control, works exactly how you would expect it to. And you can see at the bottom of the screen, that's where it is displayed. Click on menu, you can also have your temperature gauges just there as well. We can distribute the airflow, so on and so forth. We have the gloss black, gloss black trim all over the interior of this vehicle. Pop this open. 12 volt connectivity, storage just there, key storage, and also two nice size cup holders. This is what you use to control everything that happens on the screen. So you've got your drive mode, select parking sensors on and off, your parking camera, stop start on and off, your home screen, volume and contain screen off. Click on home screen. You have all these settings just there as well. If you go on colour, you have your ambient lighting colours. As you do have a wider range of colours to choose from, as you can see, just there. It's entirely up to your preferences which one you choose. Soft touch leather armor so storage just underneath as well from a touch of a button. And there's a look at the passenger's half leather and half suede front seat. Again, heated, and I'll show you both heated seats work exactly like you'd expect them to. Now, on the driver, you can control the passenger's heated seat there as well. Now, this vehicle is available to take away today with a free contactless nationwide next day delivery. And it's HBI Claire it comes a fresh service, new MOT, and we do have competitive low finance. Thank you very much for watching. Video test drive of this Mercedes Benz E220D AMG line. Now, the purpose of this video test drive today is to show that the vehicle drives exactly how you would expect it to. As you can see, I'm not able to fight with steering wheel to keep it a straight line. Go straight and true, just veer off to the left or to the right hand side. Now, we do have a multi function steering wheel with touch pads on either side. One on the right hand side controls the screen in the instrument cluster, and the one on the left hand side controls the big screen in the centre. Now, we do also have power shift if we take the car into manual mode, and you will have the cruise control and speed limiter stored just behind. Now, to activate the cruise control, when you got to your selected speed, simply just push down and go to the nearest miles an hour. Push up very slightly, it'll just buy one, and push up to your fill, a bit of a click, and it'll just to the nearest five miles an hour. Now, to cancel, simply just push away or tap the brakes, and then the cruise control will then cancel. 
Now we do have a very comfortable half leather and half suede seats throughout this vehicle. Now you can quite easily do two, three, even 400 miles and still get out feeling fresh. Now both seats are also heated, so for this cold winter mornings it really does make all the difference. Now those seats are also electrically adjustable from just down here on the side of the seat. Now you can, put, you can lift the seat up, lift the seat down and also tilt back. Now, you can quite easily do two, three, even 400 miles in this vehicle thanks to how comfy these seats are. This ride is also very comfortable going over bumps or any potholes in the road. It absorbs it very, very well. It is a very smooth driving car with no unwanted noises when you're driving along, which is what you'd be doing if you were listening out while test driving this vehicle. But if you'd be able to snap during this test driving, you wouldn't be able to hear any. So right now, I'm coming up to the industrial state where I'm going to take a right. I'm going to perform an emergency stop and pop it straight into reverse just to show that the brakes work exactly how you'd expect them to. And you'll see pop up on the centre screen the rear reversing camera. Now I just wait for a bit of traffic to move so I'll be able to pull in. Gives me a little bit more time to tell you about the car. We do have the black ash wood trim and also the gloss black trim in this vehicle. Very nice addition to add as well as the ambient lighting underneath there. So three, two, one. Bar down to the brakes, straight into reverse, no issues whatsoever. And you can see in the centre screen, the rear reversing camera and also the front and rear parking sensors. Back into drive, again, no issues whatsoever. Now, if you haven't, if we haven't answered all of your questions and inquiries during this test drive and walk around video, please feel free to get in contact with the sales team, where they can answer any unanswered questions and also run through some inquiries with you. But that's it for me in this walk around video and video test drive. Hope to hear from you soon. Cheers.